click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, in the previous video, we were comparing number of A's and number of B's and the string is accepted only in the case that number of A's are equal to number of B's. Here, we are accepting the set of all strings in which number of A's are one more as compared to number of B's. That is N of A is N of B plus one. The kind of strings which will be under this particular language would be we can say A A B or A B A let's say B A A and so on. Now let us try to draw the grammar for this particular language. You can see that the grammar that we have constructed now is much similar to the grammar which was you can see that the grammar we have constructed now is much similar to the grammar we have constructed earlier. We have replaced the elimination with epsilon by a because now at the end of the elimination everywhere we'll be replacing one a extra which will make sure that number of a's are one more as compared to number of b's let us take a small string and find the leftmost rightmost derivations and the past string let us say the string that we are considering is a a b that is two a's followed by one b the number of a's are 2, number of b's are 1, so 1 plus 1 is 2. Let's do the leftmost derivation first. Here, we are first using the first derivation to construct one pair of a and b. Now we need one more extra a, for that we can use the elimination production s produces a. You can see that we have constructed the required string. In this particular derivation, we have only one non-terminal s in the derivation and hence we can say that the leftmost derivation and rightmost derivation are similar. Let us try to draw the past tree for the same. S would be our root because S is the start symbol. We are using the production S produces A as B. Over here we have produced one pair of A and B. We need one more extra A which will be produced using S produces A. You can see that the yield of this parse tree would be A followed by one more a followed by a b which is generating the expected string a a b in which number of a's are 2 and number of b's are 1 that means number of a is exceeding number of b by 1 so far we have been solving questions for context free grammars without using any application in the next question we will be seeing one question on the basis of application of context free grammar thank you for watching this video stay tuned to ikeda and do subscribe